Should have figured Astrid would send you. Astrid didn't send me. You must be hurt if you think this is Dark Brotherhood uniform. Oh, what gave it away? <laughs> yeah, gotta admit that little jester's good with that butter knife. But don't worry, I gave as good as I got. That little jester being Cicero, I assume. Where is he? You go back to Dawnstar, or is he in there? In there. Through the door. Some old sanctuary, by the looks of it. I would have followed him, but I don't know the phrase. Well, that makes two of us. Now what you don't know... ...is that I know Cicero. I'll get him. You leave. All right, you convinced me. Doubt I'd be much good to you anyway. The little fop cut me pretty deep. But I slashed him good. Pretty sure I severed an artery. Don't know what you're gonna find in there. But you can probably just follow the blood. You are listening, are you? I should expect as much. The only reason I'm letting you live is because you're a werewolf. And I happen to be a devout follower of Persine. So it's under his name that I'm sparing your life. Innocence, my brother. Welcome. Emily taught me that one. Well, he really wasn't kidding, was he? Cicero! Astrid did not send me. I came alone. You remember me, right? Cicero never forgets a pretty face or whatever it was. Not that I'm much of a pretty face anymore. I'm not here to kill you, Cicero. I should probably stay low if there are more of those ghosts around. Damn it. But now I can't tell if that's his blood or mine.
swear the defendant. Oh, he's a stickler for details. Get it? <laughs> stickler? <laughs> oh, I slay me. <laughs> I remember that, Cicero. I remember your skill with poisons. I remember a lot about you. I'm sorry to know you've fallen so low. Cicero back before all of this. I hate to think I might have had something to do with this. This is the way I just came in, isn't it? Oh, great. That makes two of us. Cicero. I'm glad to see you still retain your sense of humor. More or less. Not exactly a Daedric Prince. Nor would I ever wish to be. Bard. Oh look. That before I came in here. Damn it. <sighs> Deep breaths. The tenants. We actually have intact copies here. Do I have... I do not. Damn it. Mofala, help me. I do not want to kill Cicero because... Because I forgot to eat.
Perhaps I should have bitten the werewolf. Chili. Mm. <laughs> You'll enjoy this. Not an original part of the sanctuary per se. Let's call it a forced addition. Forced by what? Oh, come and see. <laughs> Trolls, probably. That would be my guess. Yeah. All right. Yep. So Cicero attacked that harlot Astrid. But what's a fool to do when his mother is slapped him in mock? Surely the listener understands. I do. I do, Cicero. It's not an average troll. I would like my arrows back. Oh, they're ruined, never mind. I will, if nothing else, leave Cicero the gold. I don't really need it for anything. Oh man. That is six rows blood. Yes, it is. Cicero? Are you down there? I would, in fact, prefer that, yes. My bloodlust may have other ideas, though. I don't know. 
I came in here before he did. I kind of hope so myself. I didn't want to kill him on my own. I don't know if you remember that. Not me. And I don't really care about the lizard. And now, we come to the end of our play. The grand finale. <laughs> okay. me. I surrender. <laughs> this is real. No, oh, you prefer to listen, eh? Of course, of course, the listener listens. <laughs> a joke, a funny joke. <laughs> I get it. Then listen to this. Don't kill me. Let poor Cicero live. I attacked the strumpet bastard. I did. And I'd do it again. Anything for our mother? Return to the pretender. Tell her I'm dead. Tell her you strangled me with my own intestines. <laughs> but lie. Yes, lie. Lie and let me live. I will. Cicero, you remember me. Don't you? I remember you. I remember what you were like before all of this. It pains me to see you like this. I may not return to Astrid, but rest assured, I'm the only one who knows now. The werewolf doesn't know who I am. I will not kill you. Don't die. I may be back someday. Get out before I turn around. Is gone at least. Damn, I'm such an idiot. I'm such an idiot. Think about it. Going to town might not be the best idea. Not in this state. I don't know where to go, though. Not here. I'm a 
follow my W this right now. Okay, town isn't the best idea. I know there's a road over there somewhere. Any luck, I might be able to catch a patrol. My work. Assuming that I can get. the road before leaving the town. Maybe not. Good. I don't want to hurt anybody here. There isn't much way through. Ah. This is not good. <clears throat> Where 
Well, that's something at least. Now what? That's a good question. Might as well head to the inn. The opposite way, just in case. We'll probably be done soon. I'd rather not deal with that. Welcome. Let me know if you want anything. This one's a favorite. Wow. Well, a legend we all know and love. Holy crap. Our hero, our hero claims a warrior's heart. I tell hey, you, I Lady tell Serana. you, the oh, dragonborn comes. With a I'm actually wondering what you two are doing here. Believe, I'm right behind you. Right. The Look, I don't want to get in another brawl with you. Of all Good. Skyrim's foes, beware, beware, the dragonborn comes. For the darkness um, has passed. What troubles you, my son? What are you doing? You'll know, I'm blending you'll know as best the I can. Dragonborns come. I kind of. This is well, you may have noticed that my spell isn't exactly working right at the moment. Yeah, I can see that. Oh, well. Okay, can we head outside and away from the uh, singer? And the braggart did swagger and brandish his blade as he told the full battles and gold. Sounds like a plan. Is Serana with you? Cautious. When quiet did Ragnar the Red when he met the shield maiden right Matilda behind you. Alright, come on. Oh, you talk and you lie and you drink all our meat. Now I think it's high time that I'm right you behind you. Good. Damn, I could sing better than she did. And so then came clashing and slashing of steel. Let's hear it. Okay. So what brings you to the Dawnstar? Actually, we're headed up to the college. I kind of had a feeling you might be headed this way. We stopped here and I kind of, you know, saw the werewolf on his way out. Yeah, we might want to move. Yeah. Come on. Actually. Shall we go, or do you want to wait here until morning? Or... You know. Huh, I'm glad I'm not the only one who does that. Nah. We can all... Eh. Good. We can all run fast enough, I think we should probably get going. I'll show you... I will show you a place... Once we get far enough. Sounds good. So, uh, how did your business in, um, in Solitude go? Uh, it wasn't terrible. Alright, hopefully it stays cloudy. Hey, Cayman! Oh, 
right. You know, sometimes I forget he's in heavy armor and we're not. Yeah! If you could wait up for me just a moment. Every once in a while. That'd be great. Yeah, business in solitude was, uh... Fun. Yeah, we just passed through solitude, actually. Went down to the docks, got a ship. I just realized I should have talked to the... Uh, the ship... It's Captain Sailor Guy. Yeah, probably. Isn't this the second time we've come this way? Yes, I believe it is. I should have showed you the... Ouch. I should have showed you the place when we came down the first time, but I didn't really think about it. Gugh. You alright? Uh-huh. Have you eaten yet? Well, no, I... Arden, you need to. Although I say that having skipped on a meal myself recently, so... You know, the idea of actually biting somebody... Doesn't... it's not exactly the most appealing idea in the world. Trust me, I understand. Don't you even think about it! Bear. Bear. Saber cat. I can't tell. A big bastard, whatever he is. Eh, bear. Dear gods, that's still freezing! So you're going around instead? I might as well. And you're attracting the bear while you're at it. Looks like. Maybe not. Good. So, yeah, if we could just kind of skip the whole I haven't eaten anything yet thing, I'll deal with it when I deal with it. Right. Why exactly are we headed to the college in the first place? Uh, I need to talk to... That wasn't disconcerting in the slightest. Right, I need to talk to the librarian at the college about uh, whether or not... What would you look at that? Trying to tell us. I'm not entirely surprised. These things are everywhere around here. We're right around Sarthal, remember? And what exactly does that mean? Well, Sarthal was the first, well, supposedly, the first Nordic uh, Admoran city in Skyrim. When all the Admorans originally settled here, so... It's kind of a big deal. And then the Snow Elves kind of got all murdery and it wasn't good. And then Uskrimor came back and, you know... Genocide happened. Yep, pretty much. I just realized that you're a... You're an elf. I am indeed. I feel very strange talking to an elf about that. But here we are. And eh, no need. I'm not a snow elf.
Oh, right, you asked me about uh, the, why we're going to the college, or why I'm going to the college. Uh, uh, Lord Harkin has put out a call for a moth priest. A moth priest. Or why? You, uh... Oh, good, and the sun's coming out. Are we close? Yes, we are. Just keep running and we'll deal with it when we get there. And hopefully steer around the troll, that'd be nice. Hey, Serana, do me a favor and don't... Oh, son of a... Arden, fire would be great right now. Got one of each. Oh, great. This isn't going to end well, is it? Let the troll get him. I'm good. That is good. Nice. Yep, okay, just keep running. Because that's, that's, that sun is really hot. Do you see that little house up there? I do. That's where we're headed. I'll explain more when we get inside and I'll be able to, you know, not steam. Well, that's a nice little place, but how exactly are we supposed to get in there? Well, we can use my key. Oh, there's one right on the table there. Is this your place? Mmm, well, kind of. Ah. Nice place. Thank you. It's, uh, it's not much, but... Yeah, let me get my hood off. It's not much, but it's, uh, it's, it's, I suppose, mine. I can hear one of you with magic going. Yeah, that's probably my sword, sorry about that. You know, I'm really glad we ran into Dawnguard and not more vampires, because you really need to put that thing away. Yeah... I'm actually considering leaving it here. So, yes, Lord Harkin put out a call for a moth priest. He's gonna see if somehow by some something said moth priest will be able to read Sarana's scroll and deal the prophecy something. Oh. Oh, good. If, if Harkin is involved with a prophecy, I really just... That thought bothers me. Doesn't it just? So... Basically what I'm saying is, if you two want to stay here, I'll head up to... I almost said Castle Volgaha. No, I'll head up to the college on my own and... See what all needs doing. And that it's the middle of the day, it probably won't be as suspicious if I walk back in now as it would if I walked back in in the middle of the night. Hopefully my spell doesn't misfire again. Do you have a problem with your spells misfiring? Ha ha. No, I'm serious, that wasn't a joke. Well, I mean, it is kind of difficult to cast around plate armor, but... Frankly, I'd rather have the occasional rune go off in my face rather than, you know, getting my hands cut up. I kind of need them for writing. A very good point. So, you're leaving me here with the lovely Lady Serana. I am. Oh, speaking of lovely women, Dominique sends her regards and tells me to tell you that 
You should stop by for tea sometime. Oh. Oh, good. Yeah, I don't exactly know what that means. I assume you do. Yes. That means someone got ahead of us. Uh, I beg your pardon? Not you. Not you and me, us. I... Uh, Serrano? Although, <laughs> never mind, you can feel free to browse. I just remembered what all I've got in there, and it's not a lot, frankly. Alright, well, you do your thing. I will. I'm not going to leave, by the way. I'm not going to go stop by Dominique. I'm not going to stop by Redwater Den. While well, we've got pressing issues to attend to. Good idea. <sighs> I wish we could talk more. I really do. But, business is business. I'm just kind of glad that I caught you when I did. Likewise. Well, I will make yourself at home. I'll just be off. Right. Oh boy. No offense, Lady Serana, but I'm sure you don't want to hang around with a lowborn like myself. Very well. Uh, we'll keep ourselves entertained somehow. <sighs> Cooking, maybe. <laughs> Damn it, came and I haven't had a laugh in a while. I needed that. Hey, Arden. Mm hmm. Can I borrow your alchemy setup? Mm uh hmm. -huh. You an alchemist? <laughs> no, but I keep trying. Yeah, feel free. Ah, <sighs> good. Gods, this is going to be difficult, isn't it? Although I must say, that is gorgeous. Hmm. I've just let a vampire mercenary into basically my home now, I suppose? Ew. And it's not... It's not nearly as... cloudy out as I expected it to be. This isn't going to be good. Hey, I'll be fine. Although I probably shouldn't have lied to him about, you know, actually being fine. Yeah, okay. Shade helps. Shade helps a great deal. I... Did not. Perhaps I did. No, I did not. I was thinking I picked up a blood potion on my way out the door. I'm sorry, the idea of biting somebody just seems entirely counter to my person. Uh, right, there is one thing I need to do. Out of the sunlight. Thankfully, I don't think anybody is going to... Uh... There we go. I don't think anybody's going to be terribly concerned about a mage casting strange spells in the middle of Winterhold, considering that's kind of... 
the whole purpose. God, it's alive. That is hot and very bright. Don't wince. Morning, Frolda. Don't wince. Oof. It does not look like any progress has been made. However... God, that's bright. Okay, running. That's better. I'm hoping to at least have a message back from our contractor. I hope. Yeesh. And I think I'm going to have to resort to spending the evening with the See, my hours are all reversed now. Damn it. Oh, hello. Uh, have I seen you around? May I help you, Archmaid? Yes, I have. Hopefully one of these days that stops. I can't start nearly crying every time I walk into the Hall of the Elements. That's just unbecoming of an Archmage, I think. There he is. Hello? Study's going well? I hope. Or are you... Uh, right, you're the librarian's assistant. Sorry. Hello? Mr. Urag. May I help you, Archmage? Any word from, uh, from the contractor? No? Darn. Well, it is rather hard to get messages to Morrowin these days, so, you know. Tracking him down might be an issue. Uh, anyway, other business. I'm actually looking for a moth priest. A moth priest? What an oblivion do you need a moth priest for? Well, um... Actually, it's something to do with my enchantments, actually. Because, you know, these tattoos let me read things. I've tried to... There's not really a good way to condense that explanation down in a way that is, you know, easily said in the space of a sentence. But you know how moth priests can read things? Fine, fine. No need to get your britches in a twist. I'm not in. The it's obvious fine. answer is to go to the Imperial City. The moth priests make their home in the White Gold Tower. Sometimes they go out looking for Elder Scrolls. Lucky for you, there's a moth priest in Skyrim right now, doing just that. He stopped in to do some research in the library, then left for Dragon Bridge. If you hurry, you might catch him there. Oh, you don't say. I, uh, I just came from that particular direction, actually. I was looking for, um, an artifact. Thank you for your help, and let me know if, you know, if he ever writes back. We'll see. I've heard he's been having some... Some difficulties with House Telvani. We'll see. If 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 he doesn't work out, I'll I'll I don't know. Ask someone from the college. Uh, that reminds me. Uh, the College of Whispers, I should say, not here. I don't worry about it. 
Yes, I'm still flustered and I'm still... Was there something specific you needed? I'm positive whatever I require will be revealed to me on its own in due time. So, you don't need anything then? Oh, my dear Urag, you're trying so hard to help. I do hope you're not disappointed. Disappointed is not the word I would choose, Colette. Excuse me. Oh boy. You know... I've got to my quarters, but I kind of feel like I should help around a little bit, even if I'm tired. I don't really know what to do, actually. I kind of want to go head back to... Uh, by the gods, I'm... Indecisive and an idiot. There's not really much I can do here until we get word back. Might as well make sure King and Zorana don't, you know, blow something up. I don't think there will ever come a time when I can walk into this room without feeling... Wretched. You know, hanging around the college probably isn't the best idea anyway. I would rather not have my, uh, my condition revealed. You know, I think Savos Aaron was a prophet. Now that I think about it. Of the Veloth persuasion. <laughs> you know, that's actually rather appropriate given he's a dumber. Was a dumber. But you learn he will last several lifetimes if you're talented. Oh, again, Frolda. I'm off. Oh, if you, uh, if you get a message from, well, anyone looking for me, uh, it might be beneficial to send it down to, uh, that little, the, the hut over the, what was it? Thurs Retreat? You know, the one. Right. Thank you for your vigil vigilance. Yeah. That. And I'm guessing that since we haven't heard from a contractor, we're not going to be able to deal with any of this yet either. Great. Doesn't that just figure? Gods, that sun is hot. I'm wearing black armor, and that sun is hot. Ouch. Although, okay. Pay for that. Great, you met your fellows, did you? Okay. Ooh. I need to get in the shade. Okay. Alright, lead them away from the other two. That'd be good. Why didn't you drop the crossbow and fight me like a Nord? I can't tell if you are a Nord. Okay, okay, okay. Don't stop to loot them. Just go. Ouch. K 
Okay, and I'm stuck. This is not good. Okay. Alright. Okay, this is actually terrifying. I'm- I've got my foot wedged in a rock in the middle of the day. Okay. Right. That was not exactly the kind of life or death situation that I expected I'd ever be in. 